Hey y'all, it is Larry from the tiny cabin, and uh, it's morning, and I, well, well, not not really, it's 10.50. I've been asleep, so it's morning to me. It was 39 in here this morning when I woke up, so I just went back to bed and stayed there for a while. Anyway, um, they're blowing up bombs at uh, McAllister right now, and so the dog's been freaking out about that. Anywho, um, it's a mess in here, so I can't show a whole lot, but I wanted to show that oh, for the first time in a while, I am completely charged up. And when they're both flashing, that means that uh, the one flashing means the solar panel is working, and the other one says the battery's full. So, my little thingy here, if we can see it. It's not making it very clear, is it? There we go. Got 14.3 volts. It's still charging um, at 5.5 amps. But this is the first time we've had sun in four days, five days. We had we had a little bit of sun for maybe an hour or two the other day, but other than that, there's been nothing. So it's been uh, it's been a mess here as far as uh, power. I haven't been able to do much of anything. Not that there's much to do anyway, but um, I've had the uh, had the heater on quite a bit because, well, it's been 12 degrees. Uh, what else? I got uh, I got my fan up there going because uh, it's you can't see it in the picture, but it's it's pointed down. It's sucking the hot air from up on the ceiling down and moving it around. Um, like I said, it's, it's, it's a mess in here. Um, there's a dog. But that was really about it. I just wanted to let everybody know that A, I'm still alive and B, I have power again. And I don't even, I didn't actually do one on the new charge controller, did I? Huh. Uh, my other charge controller that I had, the, uh, well, whatever one you saw last, uh, it died. And uh, the Renogy one that came with the kit, it died also. It decided that my battery was suddenly magically putting out 84 volts. So it thought that the battery was fully charged and it wouldn't charge. Um, so I posted, uh, I posted about that on Facebook and... A friend of mine got me a Christmas present, so I've got a I got a tracer and uh, the remote. That's the remote for it, and uh, it works much more gooder. <laughs> it works much better than the uh, than the cheapies I had before. Um, it's uh, it's amazing how how much power it can actually generate when it's cloudy and. There's hardly any light out there, because with this one you can you can see the uh, you can actually see the uh, the solar panel come on, and it'll it'll start out at like 0.3 volts, and it'll go to 0.5, and then it'll keep go ramping up. So by 6:45 this morning, it was already putting out 13.6 volts. So it started to charge a little bit then. Um, it was charging at 0.1 amps, but still it was charging a little bit. And now it is uh, 10.54, and it's 62 degrees in here. And uh, so by 10, well, it was actually probably an hour earlier, by about 9 o'clock, 9 or 10 o'clock, uh, it was already fully charged. So that was pretty awesome. So um, there just really is not a whole lot going on here because it's cold and I don't do anything when it's cold. Um, I, I wish I had new windows. This one, and it's all melted now. This window is completely iced up. There was like a half inch of ice down at the bottom of it. And uh, I've got, I've got a uh, dog food bag over this one. To uh, block the uh, block the wind a little bit, from blowing through it, because these windows really are crap. They are uh, 
they're basically storm windows. Um, single single pane, thin aluminum crap. Normal, you know, normal shed stuff. So hopefully one day I'll uh, be able to get some real windows to put in there. Um, I think that is it, really. Like I said, not a whole lot going on, and plus my videos are usually way too long anyway. So, uh, so we'll call this one good. Um, so key points: new new tracer uh, charge controller with remote. It's charging good, and dog dog whines when when booms go off, and I got a wall, and yeah, that's about it. So, talk to y'all later. Bye.